Hello, Loho. You are a student at Baltic Aviation Academy yeah. from France. Uh, could you introduce yourself a little bit shortly and tell us what is your experience in aviation? Okay, so my experience in aviation is a very small experience, four years of study, but only uh, 250 hours of flying on small plane. So it was very interesting to come there for the Boeing 737. What kind of plane uh, there was? Little plane. It was Grob 115 and Diamond. Something like Cessna? Yes, similar as Cessna and uh, Diamond DA42. Mm -hmm. It was a twin engine, a small twin engine, but the only experience I have. Did you enjoy it? The, the experience before? Yes, a lot. Uh, more on the twin, the DA42, it was very interesting, but small planes are very interesting. Uh, now you are doing your trainings at uh, Boeing 737, yeah. and is this your first type? Yes, ratings? it's my first type. Rating, and yes. uh, what was that um, you uh, decided to learn uh, exactly on this type? Normally, we have the choice between 737 and Airbus A320, and uh, it was. Uh, the main reason is the price because the Boeing 737 is a little bit more less expensive. Uh, what was the influence you decided to become a pilot? The main influence is one time I uh, asked to go in a cockpit during a flight and I've been fascinated by, uh, by the cockpit so I want to become a pilot. Great. <laughs> and now you were doing your uh, type rating uh, at Baltic Aviation Academy. Could you tell us a little bit more about your learning process? Uh, it was very good, very intensive all the time but uh, very good. All the ground school was intensive, simulator intensive, but uh, very interesting. Uh, could you tell about your experience with an instructors? Uh, was it uh, good to work together or was a little bit complicated? Oh, yeah. I mean, Douglas was a good instructor, uh, very kind and very hard when I was bad. <laughs> and uh, how did you decide to study at Baltic Aviation Academy? Was it an advice or you found uh, a recommendation somewhere? No, I saw the advice in, on the internet and uh, the possibility of doing line training was uh, a great part of my decision. So did the conditions meet expectations? Was it like the expected? Yes, good because the planning was uh, good. No simulator during the night, there was the shuttle. And so we don't waste time here to, to go here. So it was a good, uh, good facility to study there. And what about the atmosphere at uh, our training center? Uh, because you are far away from home, so how does it feel? Oh yes, but Lithuania is not so different from France. So it's quite, it's, similar? It's quite easy to adapt there, I think, to adapt in Lithuania. No, it's not so different. So I wish you good luck and thanks for your answers and goodbye. Thank you. <laughs>